Hi guys, it's Andy here from Awesome 3D Prints again, and I just want to show you my new prints. Only a quick one this time, but there it is. Look at that. It's a catapult. Ideal little fun toy, really. Um, printed out of PETG this time because PLA kept breaking, so you need something a bit more robust than uh, than standard PLA. ABS, if you can. My printer won't do ABS. I haven't got an enclosure. Printed at uh, 0.2 layer height, 25% infill to give it a bit more strength, and three perimeter walls, but it works. Seems to work pretty well. We also made some of these just on Tinkercad, uh, just some spheres, and then printed them off to give it something to fire. I'll uh, show you the printer now, and then we'll kill some stuff with it afterwards. <laughs> Cheers, guys. Guys, here at the shooting gallery, I've got my uh, my weapon. I've got my ammo. Let's see if we can manage to kill some robots with it before they take over the world. All right, that's it loaded. Let's see if we can. Oh man! No, I'll get it in a minute. Don't worry. Oh, cracking shot. Nailed it right in the chest. And this one, this one's going to be a bit more difficult. It's at a weird angle. Oh, let's see if you can focus in on that one. There we go. Ready. Uh, no, that went way too high. Seems got quite a bit of power in it because it's just a little piece of plastic. No, not quite right. I'm running out of ammo, so we need to kill it soon. Oh, come on. That should have finished it off. Only winged him. Uh, that's that one gone as well. And that one. Oh, man. Ah, oh, he's now lost an arm and a leg, but he's still standing. These kill bots aren't very uh, easy to kill. Oh, same leg again. <laughs> right, here you go. Last try. I reckon I got him this time. Yeah, absolutely nailed him. <laughs> well, that was good fun. Um, for a little toy, it's pretty good, to be honest. Um, if you fancy just having a bit of a battle with your kids or whatever, it's great fun. I'll put a link in the description, as I said earlier, um, so you can find it. And if you want to design yourself some of these little balls that I've now lost all of them, uh, go on to Tinkercad, just generate a sphere, download it, and print it off. Anyway, guys, if you like my video, you know what to do. Give me a thumbs up. And if you want to see more, subscribe and tick the bell icon to make sure you get notified as and when I do a new video. Cheers guys, take care.